Hi, uh, do you want to know how to plot multiple location like this in uh, Shift UI uh, map? So let's see how to mark the multiple location and how to route our uh, uh, destination in this Shift UI location. Okay. Yeah. Hi. Uh, so in last video, we uh, we saw about how to plot our current location uh, in Shift UI, uh, Shift UI map. So this time, this time we are going to see how to mark plot a multiple. Uh, uh, mark multiple location in our application okay so let's see and, and quick jump into an application so this is our last code this is the same thing so i'm just going to add one search view in the search view i'm going to uh, type some address and once searched it will plot for the other plot okay so that's what we are going to do i'll just add one search field in here so this is a v stack so after the v above the v stack i'm just adding one h stack okay hashtag in the hashtag i just add one text field okay text field in the text field the text should be search location then i'm just adding where is it here only i'm just adding one state property state property sorry i'm just adding one state property so that is like where text so search location string okay oh, it's not this one okay so this search location will go over here this is double way binding okay so once the search location is done on commit i'm going to add something over here okay dot padding okay in the padding i just some simple padding and once the padding is done we are going to add dot text text field style is round border text field set okay so this is a text field then i am going to add one search okay search button actually okay so button action okay so in the action i am going to do something later so in the label i am going to add image okay so image image system name uh, so system name actually I'm going to use magnificent glass so it's a set actually set one dot padding background will add background we can add a circle okay circle okay circle dot circle the circle foreground will be dot blue okay gray dot opacity 0 0.3 okay so this is how the search will work okay um let's see if i can give preview canvas okay i'll just run the preview once the preview is done i'll just let you know okay this one we don't need okay okay so this button is done so we have the things so now uh, we need to uh, okay here so now you can see the search okay right in the top top one so we have a, a button and search so when the search is there we are going to plot the another one okay so before that i'll just reduce this to three so this one we need to alter many things over here too so let's order let alter later i'll just go to the location manager okay in the location manager is the main work we have a lot of things to do in location manager so first of all we have to um, add a search uh, location okay so in here we have a user address and user location right for that same kind of thing i'll add uh, search location and search address search location and search address search address so just for uh, showing that okay so in the search location we are going to add get the search location we are going to create one function and again okay so uh, this one i am go going to create the make this uh, what is it so i just uh, this geocoder as a global geocoder okay so why because we are we need to use for user address and that one address also so we can't use these things for commonly so i'll just create this function as a common function right function get get address okay okay so in this get address we are going to add um, coordination 
okay so uh, that we, i am i'm not going to return anything actually uh, here so because this is a lambda function so the returning is a little bit uh, difficult to over here so i'm just coordinate the coordinate will be location cll location then i am having going to call back okay call back should be escape parameter because this is a escape para this is a escape uh, lambda so i am going to add escaping so first is we are returning a string right so the data will be string so i am adding a parameter as string and the return type is nothing okay so now the using this callback function so instead of location i am just adding this coordination so using this callback function instead of this user address i am adding this address string okay so the same thing i am go uh, going to use this one over here okay funds okay get address okay so this one will be location i can add this one okay uh, then here address in okay so address okay so now uh, the same process before how we did the same thing i am doing with the again with the separate function okay this is how this will do it so now we are going to uh, take a, a search okay so for the search i am going to create another one function not private function okay search location okay search location i am going to uh, yes search query search query means the input which we are typing okay string okay so uh, string so now i am going to get uh, create one search request so in map itself we have a search request okay r e q e s t request okay request m k local search okay local search dot request okay i am just creating a local search dot request now the search request dot natural language query is equal to search query okay so this is the search query we set it so now from the uh, mk local search we are going to send this uh, request okay let search is equal to mk local search so in the search you can see the parameter called request so in the request we are going to send the search request so once we send the search request we can get started getting the uh, locations based on the search okay search dot start okay so this is what uh, we are going to use so in this compilation uh, comp uh, compilation handler only we will get two things response comma error okay okay so response comma error so we are going to get uh, response and error so in the response only uh, you will get everything so first we will guard the response so okay so i am going to get, now i am going to get only one request for that guard i am let response response okay then i am going to this is for response is not null then i am going to do another one thing let item is equal to dot map item dot first so if the first is there we are going to pause or we are going to return okay or we are going to return uh, the error we can print the error okay so this is how it will work so then after guard we are going to do our normal logics okay so the normal logics is like we are going to create one coordinate is equal to item dot placemaker dot coordinates okay so this is the coordinate so we, this we, this coordinate only we are going to set it in the map right okay self dot search location okay is equal to coordinate okay so this co with this coordinate we are going to search um, in that one so another next one we are going to uh, this is for plotting this right so then um, we can take the uh, location address for this one also okay if get location is equal to item dot play dot location okay so if the location is not null we are going to get get address okay in this address location i'm going to pass so in here i'm going to address in so okay self dot search address okay search address is equal to address okay so i set the address over here so uh, based on this we are going to do in our map view how we are going to use it okay uh, okay i think 
it's done let's see it is fixed okay whether it's run because without an error okay so now we are going to use this one in a map and based on this we are going to use it okay so we are going we, we, we just need to alter some of the features from our old thing so we don't need this on up here okay so no more so because we are going to get uh we are going to use the identifier uh in different ways so we don't need this one okay so i'm uh, before removing this i am just creating the uh another one okay like like another one like we are going to create uh, usually we are normally we are going to create one function okay private function create annotations okay so i am just creating annotations and i am returning the identifier okay identifier is this identifiable location okay this identifiable location so because that location only we are giving here where is it in the map so this one this annotation is identifiable annotation okay so that one only we are going to return so in the return place we are going to create to add the where annotations is equal to identification location then we are creating it so now i am going to let user location is equal to user location okay then if let search location is equal to search location okay so inside the user location i am going to annotation dot okay uh, append okay identifiable location coordinate okay so in the coordinate i'm going to use user location okay so uh, uh that's fine oh let's okay so this one is uh, search location so the problem is now we don't okay return, i'll just return annotations okay so the problem is now i don't uh i uh uh, the problem is now i don't know which is uh, current address and which is search address okay so for that do, for doing those things i'm going to add one more uh, flag over here is let is current address is equal to bool okay so okay is current address I'm going to dot is current address is equal to is current address. Okay. So the same thing I'm going to add it over here. Comma is what happened? Okay, left we don't need. Okay. Okay list current address is equal to true because the user address is a current address current address means it's a uh, current user address i have the flag we, we can change it later so this one is false okay so this is the same thing so i just remove this annotate uh, what is that on appear one so i just remove the on appear one uh, instead of removing i'll just commenting it so okay so in the annotation part i am just giving create annotations okay so in the annotation yeah, i am just giving a create annotation okay so here uh, item dot coordinate okay so i am giving item dot coordinate so then we have another one thing is tint tint okay in the tint i am going to give item dot is current user or if it is a, if this is a current user dot current user means it is blue or it's red okay so now the pointer will be blue or red okay uh, so that's how it will be so just uh, i think most of everything is done uh, let's see it let's run and search some address and check okay uh, so uh, okay i'm running the application so one more thing also we need to do we need to show the address of the current address okay so i'll just uh, do that one also you can see it over here okay so i am just creating so see you can now our current uh, thing is pointing as blue so i am just i didn't search anything okay okay i'm just searching uh one second uh where is the search okay so in search action button we didn't do anything <laughs> sorry okay so that's the one uh, okay let's see um, location manager dot 
search address location the query should be the text one okay the search string okay this search string so already we added the search string over here so the search string we gave here so now i'll just uh, run once more once again so in the once again uh, it will work it will be plotted in the both sides okay let's see okay i'm just giving street name i'm just searching where it is yeah you can see it over here right so it is plotting uh for this so actually the zooming is different so let's change the span to in the location manager so location manager i'll just create this span like right? this span is very zoom mean span so we'll add one common span okay so the common span is span is mk coordinate span okay we don't need this actually i'll just copy and i'm just pasting it here instead of 005 i'll put 02 i'll put 02 okay so i'm going to use this one wherever i'm using the mk pan okay okay here one more thing not here this one okay this one only okay so uh, the thing is we can do this one same thing for this search address also okay this coordinate okay i'm just the coordinate is added what is this okay i think the property will go okay so i'll just go stop it and run it again it runs i think i will need to show you okay yeah okay map i'm searching okay yeah you can see right you can see actually that we can plot the two points whatever the point so that that is because of the user update so it's going okay so the, the current address to that one so uh, in the future video we are going to see how to route how to mark the plot uh, route maker route uh, for the automobile uh, it's like car how to navigate to that place and how to list the search uh, what are all the all the list search i am showing that and we need to show current address in the bottom okay so this is how we need to do in the future video oh let's see okay